Also breaking tonight, we now know the name of the young man killed today by a shark on Cape Cod. Authorities telling us tonight the victim is 26-year-old Arthur Medici of Revere. A surfer sent us this video showing a crowd of people rushing to carry the young man off of Newcomb Hollow Beach. Good evening, everyone. I'm Ken McLeod. Katie is off tonight. Witnesses say Medici was boogie boarding when the shark attacked. WBZ's Jim Smith reports from the beach that it's now closed to swimmers. Well, this is what so many people down here on Cape Cod have been worried about for so long, and now, tragically, it has come to pass. Take a look here behind me. Signs warning people about sharks have been posted here at the beach for quite some time, and now a young man has lost his life. All of a sudden, somebody yells, shark, shark. There were just a ton of people screaming, asking for help. A nightmare at Newcomb Hollow Beach in Wellfleet. A young man bitten by a shark, and this time it's fatal. Witnesses say the victim was boogie boarding and suddenly attacked. There was just somebody in the, somebody had him by, by his, like, underneath his arms, sitting in the, in the surf. You know, they had him supported up, his head up, but yeah. in the surf, and other people came down with towels and wrapped his legs in towels. We have an unconscious male, severe leg injuries. Around noontime today, our department received a 911 call of a possible shark attack in the water. A male potty in his mid-20s was brought out of the water, and CPI was in progress. The victim is 26-year-old Arthur Medici of Revere. A longtime surfer says people did everything they could, but there were severe leg wounds. There were uh, half a dozen people trying to stop the bleeding with towels and the, uh, I guess, the cord from the boogie board. Police closed the beach to swimming on one of the prime weekends of the September season. Even longtime Cape Codders now realize things have changed thanks to a surging shark population. It's just crazy. I mean, I come to this beach all the time, so it's a little, you know, it's scary and, and really sad for my shark was out for that family. Police tell me the protocol after a shark attack is to close the beach for 24 hours. It remains to be seen if further action will be taken. In Wellfleet on the Cape, Jim Smith, WBZ News.